Hi guys, uh, continue tayo sa soil properties. So this time, uh, magsasolve tayo ng problem. So provided meron tayo dito ng uh, example, meron tayong moist sample, uh, meron siyang volume total which is 0.33 uh, cubic feet. Then yung moist uh, weight niya is 39.93 pounds. Then yung over and dry niya is we have 34.54 pounds. Then yung specific gravity ng soil is we have 2.71. So, yung tinatanong dito is ano daw yung moisture content. So, tingnan nga. Ayan. Na? So, we have the dry unit weight. You have the void ratio, porosity, volume of voids, volume of solids, volume of air, and the degree of saturation. So, yan yung tinatanong dito sa... Uh, problem so para masolve natin ito gagamit tayo lahat ng formula for the soil properties so yung soil properties are really formula based na? so kailangan memoryada mo lang yung formula wala kang problema pag di mo memoryada yung formula ayan na? pagsasasihan mo hindi mo memoryada na? kasi uh, minsan uh, ang daming problem kasi sa soil properties na formula based talaga kailangan talaga natin memoryado yung formula okay so solve natin yung problem so yung unang tinatanong ano daw yung moisture content and alam natin yung moisture content di ba? kung babalikan natin yung una ito yun so yun yung gagamitin natin So, we have the weight of the water over the weight of the solid. And we all know weight of water is weight total. Then, the weight dry. All over weight dry. Okay? So, weight total is we have, ito yun, no? Moist is also the weight total. Okay? So, we have 39.93 minus weight dry we have 34 39.93 34 34.54 all over 34.54 so multiply ko na lang to by 100 para makuha ko in terms of percentage so we have 15.61% okay next ano daw yung moist unit weight na ano daw to so okay na ako dito next is ito so alam natin yung moist unit weight is meron tayong formula na weight total over volume total so therefore this is 39.93 all over uh, 0.33 0.33 so therefore this is 121 pounds per cubic feet so ito na yung sagot next so ano daw yung dry unit weight So, we have Y dry. So, Y dry. That is. Weight dry all over volume. Total. Okay. So, we will have the dry 34.54. 34.54 all over 0.33. So, therefore, we have 104.67 pounds per cubic feet. Next, ano daw yung void ratio? Okay. So, yung void ratio, diba? that is just the volume of voids divided by the volume of the solid. And, based upon formula, pwede natin gamitin yung sa so y dry. 
this j unit weight of water 1 plus e ano pang may formula ng y dry so i think okay na to so since wala pa tayong volume ng void so hindi pa natin magamit try natin gamitin yung y dry okay so try kong gamitin to so we will have now uh, since given no? so therefore we have 104.67 all over uh, specific gravity is given 2.71 so 2.71 times so since naka pounds to yan naka pounds so this must be 62.4 all over 1 plus e so thus we have the value of e that is 0 0.61 okay next ano daw yung porosity so yung porosity which is the value of n that is volume of voids over volume total na. Since wala pa tayong medyo kulang tayong given, try natin gamitin din yung A plus 1 plus A. So, since nakuha na natin yung A, masolve na natin yung value ng porosity. So, we will have 0 0.61 all over 1 plus 0 0.61 and that is 0 0.38. Okay. Next is ano daw yung volume ng voids. Ayan. No. So, pwede tayong gumamit kahit saan, no? So, dito na ako, eh. So, gamitin ko na lang yung porosity. So, volume of voids, volume total. So, thus, volume of voids will be and volume of total. So, we have 0 0.38 times 0 0.33, yeah? 0 0.33. So, we will have now 0 0.125 cubic feet twenty five cubic feet so ito na yung sagot next is ano daw yung number na to five six number seven uh, we have volume of solids okay yan yung vs so yung vs so we will have porosity uh, no void ratio that is vv over the vs so pwede na natin gamitin to so vs will be vv all over e okay so we have 0 0.125 all over e which is 0. 61. So, therefore, we have 0 0.205 cubic feet. So, ito na yung sagot. Next is, ano daw yung volume of air? No? This VA. Okay? So, masolve natin yan by volume of voids. We have volume of air plus the volume of water. So, thus, volume of air is just volume of voids minus volume of water. Ito, wala na akong problema. So, yung may issue na ako is yung ito. And we all know unit weight is weight over the volume. So, yung water to, so dapat water to, water to. Okay? And yung water is weight total minus weight dry all over volume of water. So, masolve na natin yung volume of water. That is weight total minus the weight dry all over unit weight of the water. So thus, volume of water is we have 39.93 minus 34.54. Yeah. Then, no? 39.93 minus 34.54 divided by the weight of water, which is. 
therefore this is 0 0.086 cubic feet okay so masolve na natin ngayon yung volume of air that is volume of voids minus volume of the water so volume of voids is we have 0 0.125 then the volume of water is we have 0 0.086 so thus we have um, zero point zero three nine cubic feet so yan na yung sagot next is ano daw yung degree of saturation so, yung degree of saturation, maraming ways pag-solve nito eh, kasi ang dami ng given. Ang dami ng properties na nakuha natin. But anyway, gamitin ko na lang yung guess. So, we have 2.71. Then, compute na natin to. This is 15.61. Uh, so, we have 0. 1561 void ratio na compute na din natin no? that is 0 0.61 and so the degree of saturation will be 0 0.6935 or that is 69.35 percent so I think uh, yan lang for the soil properties so next is uh, magbigay lang din ako ng isa pang example regarding with the soil properties so so far yung soil properties talaga is formula guys huh? so I think that's it thank you